Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be cash stuffing my July paycheck number two. I have in here six hundred and three dollars that I'm gonna be cash stuffing. As always, I'm gonna start off with my wallet here. And let's see, we have personal. Personal won't be getting anything today, it's empty. Next we have self-care. Self-care will be getting $10. So let's go ahead and give it a count. We have 20, 30, 35, 40, and 45 dollars here so far for self-care. I do use this envelope for like any toiletries that I may need. So that's my self-care envelope. Next I have eating out. And for this I'm gonna be cash stuffing $50. I have four dollars left here so these four dollars are gonna go into my one dollar challenge and let's go ahead and add a 50 that's gonna be a 50 dollar bill and this envelope here is for groceries and eating out all right there we go that is all i have for my cash envelopes i'm gonna be adding here the screenshot of fetch if you guys want to check that out and the link is in the description box down below as well um, that's just an app where you can scan your receipts you get points for scanning your receipts and you can redeem those points for gift cards so make sure to check that out so next over here i have my first binder that i'm gonna be cash stuffing and we're gonna be starting off with phone bill so phone bill will be getting ten dollars so now we have 10 15. next i have health insurance that will be getting thirty dollars so twenty and a ten so health insurance has twenty forty fifty and sixty dollars so far Next we have rent and rent is getting 125. So that's 100, 820, and a five. So rent has 100, 220, 40, 45, and 50. So 250 for rent. I do pay $500, so we're halfway through. Next we have my grandma's envelope and for her, I'm gonna be stuffing $10. She's gonna be getting two fives. So my grandma has 10, 20, 25, and 30. So we got 30 for her envelope. And my goal here is gonna be $50 for my grandma to send her at the end of this month. So next we have my dog's envelope. And for my dog, I'm gonna be stuffing $10. So now he has 15. Okay, and next here we have investments. And for investments, I'm gonna be stuffing $20. So investment has $500, $600, $700, $750, $760 in, the, in my investment accounts. Um, I do use two accounts and I do try to invest $100 each in the month. But if I don't get to accomplish that, it's fine. But this is how much I have invested into my accounts. So in cash, I have $20, $40, and $45. And if you're interested on in getting your six free stocks with Weevil, don't forget to check out my description box down below. I have all the three steps down there that you have to follow so you can get your six free stocks value up to $12,600. So if you did sign up with my link and open your account and deposit as little as one penny, let me know which stocks you guys got. I'm really excited to know um, your stocks that they were able to give you. So yeah, that is it for this binder. Now let's go ahead and move on to this one. So I'm gonna be starting off with my savings. I'm gonna be stuffing $10 here. So savings has 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 100, 200, 300. So $4,300 in my account. And we have 20, 30, 40, and 45 dollars in cash. So 4,345 dollars. 
that we have for savings. Okay, next we have month ahead that will be getting $13. So let me get a 10 and 3 ones. So 1, 2, and 3. So almost done with this challenge, guys. Super exciting. So let's do one of these. By the way, guys, these trackers right here are available on my Etsy shop. You can get the hard copy or you can get all of the trackers, which comes eight of them. And you can get them in digital um, download where you can just print it out at home. So it's really up to you which one you would like to get. So for month ahead, I have 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 50, 70, 80, 90, 91, 92, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So 598 dollars. Like I said, I only need like three little can I mean four little calendars here, so I can reach my 650 dollar goal that I have. And this is only for my bill. So this includes my rent, my health insurance and my phone bill so those are the only three that I'm counting towards my month ahead um, so for car I'm gonna be adding $25 so it's gonna be a 20 and a 5 okay so let's just Finish coloring in this car here. And let's see, we have $1,000, $2,000, $3,500 in my high yield savings account for a car, and then I have 20, 40, 45, and 50. So $3,550 for a car. And this is for me to get a car in the future. I'm not really rushing towards this, but I'm just saving for it. For car insurance, I'm going to be stuffing $5. So car insurance has $50, $55, and $60. Okay. Next, we have moving, but I'm not going to be stuffing this envelope. We have $1,000, $2,000, $3,025. $3,025. I'm just putting a pause here until I feel like I want to stuff this envelope again not yet because um, I am trying to focus on other things for now and it has a good amount it has three thousand dollars in the bank um, so yeah my goal here is like five thousand so I need like two more thousand dollars so I can reach my goal but right now I'm just you know pausing a little bit from this envelope so for my parents, I'm going to be adding $20. So my parents have 50, 70, 80, 85, 90, 91, and 92. They have $92. I did buy two hip belts, um, one for my dad, one for my mom. My dad right now is not feeling that well from his lower back. So I went to Amazon and I found the hip belt so I bought one for my dad and then I bought one for my mom too because um, she's also not feeling well from her sciatica I think that's how you say it um, so yeah she I, I bought two one for my dad one for my mom I hope it helps them with their pain and we're gonna see if it does so that's one of the reasons that I'm trying to focus more stuffing this envelope here so next we have Joel's envelope and he will be getting three dollars so one two and three so he has 50 70 71 two and three so 73 dollars okay next i have my envelope and for me i'm gonna be adding three dollars So I have 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15 dollars so far. Okay, health is getting 15 dollars. 
So 10 and a 5. So health has 10, 20, 25, 26, and 27. 27 for health. And this envelope I'm using for like any like equipment that I might need for working out or any supplements, any um, medications that I might need, you know, it's just all combined. So next for clothes, clothes will be getting $15, so a 10 and a 5. So clothes has 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, and 38. 38 for clothes. Okay, next we have gifts. Oops. And gifts is getting $5. So gifts has 100, 5, 10, and $15. I need to see what I'm going to be getting my one of my best friends because her birthday is coming on Sunday. So it's really near the corner. So I really need to see what I'm going to buy her. So the amount on this envelope is going to go down. Um, maybe my next video, I'm going to have less in there. We're going to see. So let's see. For Christmas, we will be stuffing $15. So a 10 and a 5. And let me move this up. Let's color in one of this. All right, so Christmas has 100, 200, 300, 350, 370, 380, 390, 395, 405. So we have reached the $400 mark, so $405 for Christmas. My goal here is $675, so we are making good progress. Definitely good progress. Alright. So that is it for this binder, guys. Now let's go ahead and move on to my last one here. And we will be starting off with my Etsy taxes. And for this, I will be stuffing $94. So that's a 50, 70, 90, 90, 1, 2, 3, and 4. Okay. So let's organize this. So Etsy Texas has $1,000, $2,000, $2,000, $100, dollars in the bank. And then we have $200, 250 $300, $20, $40, $60, $80, $4, $4, $5, $10, $11, $12, $13, $14, $15, $16, $17, $18. So $4,18. So $2,418 for Etsy Texas. Okay, next we have shipping and this will be getting $15, so 5, 10, 15. So, so, <laughs> so shipping has 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 41, 2, 3, 4, 5, so $45 for shipping, which is good. My supplies, this is for any materials that I might need in my Etsy shop. Um, supplies, it's getting, it's getting $15. No, not 15, sorry guys, $50, 50. So supplies has 50 and 70. $70 for supplies. I did have to buy a lot of materials guys, because you guys have been buying from my Etsy shop. So thank you guys so much for that. Equipment is not getting anything, but I believe it has $25. Yeah, it has $25 in there. Next, we have P.O. Box, and that will be getting $5. So 
So PO Box has 20, 25, and 30 dollars here. Emergency fund. This envelope broke on me again, so I just decided to keep like this. So emergency fund is getting forty-five dollars. So twenty, forty, and a five. There we go. So emergency fund has one hundred, two hundred, three hundred, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty. 85, 86, 87, 88, 89. So $389 if I'm not wrong. So I'm trying to beef this up. I did take a good amount. If you guys have been watching my videos, I did take a good amount from this. I did have $2,000, but I did have to take out $1,696. So I'm trying to build this back up, which I'm trying to. So $1 challenge will be getting my $4 from my eating out envelope and we're starting this um, challenge again for the next six months of the year and my 52 week savings challenge is not getting anything but it has 100, 200, 300, 400, 500 and 600 dollars that I might deposit into my high yield savings account but I'm gonna do that at the end of this month, not yet. Okay, so that is it guys for my cash stuffing of my July paycheck number two. I do want to let you guys know that for my next video, I am going, going to have um, another cash stuffing before my July paycheck number three. I'm going to have my Shopify paycheck cash stuffing next, which will be on Monday. So I hope you guys stay tuned and turn on the notification bell so that way you are notified when I do upload that video. I'm super excited guys, it's gonna be my first cash stuffing from my Shopify. So thank you guys so much to everybody who supported my Shopify. Um, that's just gonna be like an extra income that I'm gonna be getting. So thank you guys so much for that. So I hope you guys stay tuned and hopefully I can see you guys on Monday. So yeah, I'll see you then, bye.